This is a big one. This is the 12,000 species in the photo arc. That's an Arabian cobra. He doesn't like me too much, can you tell? <laughs> and uh, this was photographed two weeks ago in the United Arab Emirates at the Arabian Wildlife Center. So there he is, 12,000. Fantastic. Only 8,000 more to go. You're gonna be busy. Yeah, I am. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, the ladies' room is in the other direction. Ah, uh, actually, I was hoping to make a call in, in private. The back room is off limits to visitors. This is um, a matter of life and death and, and, and paternity. And I promise not to steal any of the artwork. It's really not my taste anyway. All right, but please be quick. Thank you. Come on. Come on. I need to reach Valentine. Excuse me. Excuse me, everyone. Hello, hi. Hello, thank you all so much for being here tonight. The Jerome Gallery is honored to present the National Geographic Photo Arc, led by National Geographic explorer and photographer, Joel Sartori. <laughs> the National Geographic Photo Arc is really uh, an extraordinary multi-year effort to document all species living in zoos and aquariums and wildlife sanctuaries, and these all oh, inspiring images around you. They're just a fraction of the photo art. In fact, Joel announced today that he has taken portraits of over 12,000 species of animals on this planet. Thanks for being here. Unfortunately, about a million species now are threatened with extinction. National Geographic and I partnered about 15 years ago to start documenting all 20,000 that we think are in the world's zoos, wildlife sanctuaries, aquariums. And we've turned a big corner with our 12,000 species recently, an Arabian cobra you can see right around the corner. So the goal really is to engage the public and also to fund long-term conservation efforts on the ground. Uh, I want to take this opportunity to, to basically thank Trina Robinson for reaching out to our staff, which led to all this, and also to Ava Jerome of Jerome Galleries, and also to all of you for being here today and caring. So thanks very much. Where were you? Long line at the ladies' room. Well, now, I'm sure that you're all very eager to buy a print or two of one of these photographs and for such a worthy cause. But first, I know that Trina Robinson has something that she would like to present to Mr. Sartori. Um, as, as many of you know, it was Trina that first made me aware of the photo art project. And it's only thanks to her efforts that this night is happening at all. So uh, Trina, wherever you are, come here, please. Thank you. 